She was very much half dressed, and big indiscreet trees threw out their leaves against the pane, cunningly and close, quite close. Sitting half naked in my big chair, she clasped her hands. Her small and so delicate feet trembled with pleasure on the floor. The color of wax, I watched. A little wild ray of light fluttered on her smiling lips, and on her breast, an insect on the rose bush. I kissed her delicate ankles. She laughed softly and suddenly, a string of clear trills, a lovely laugh of crystal. The small feet fled beneath her petticoat. Stop it, do! The first act of daring permitted. Her laugh pretended to punish me. Softly I kissed her eyes, trembling beneath my lips, poor things. She threw back her fragile head. Oh, come now, that's going too far. Listen, sir, I have something to say to you. I transferred the rest to her breast, in a kiss which made her laugh with a kind laugh that was willing. She was very much half dressed, and big indiscreet trees threw out their leaves against the pane, cunningly and close, quite close.